Atlanta City Council had a very busy 2023. They signed off on key public safety funding along with affordable housing and youth initiatives. 11 Live's Joe Ripley has more on what City Council expects to tackle this year. 2023 marked a year of protest, promise and potential for Atlanta City Council. Demonstrators continued to protest the construction of a new and controversial public safety training center for Atlanta police and firefighters. Dozens were arrested, but the city expects the facility to be completed by the end of this year. Council also approved funding for public safety officer retention efforts, take home police vehicles and new equipment and engines for firefighters. Atlanta City Council President Doug Shipman says it could take months to see the fruits of their labor, but says the city has backed up its promises with funding. I think you saw council really trying to make sure that we had the resources to match the needs across the city, funding affordable housing initiatives, funding uh, homeless initiatives, addressing folks who are living outside. You saw a doubling of parks funding, which is the first time in decades that you've seen that. A lot of investment in transportation and sidewalks. Shipman says the city has already invested millions of dollars in youth initiatives as well as affordable housing and expects similar investments and groundbreakings throughout 2024. He also expects council to tackle a tree protection ordinance, update its short-term rental licensing program, build on the city's comprehensive development plan, and upgrade the city's trash pickup and recycling service. Coming up at 5, you'll hear from one Atlanta resident explain why the topic of affordable housing is such a crucial one and a personal one for him. In Atlanta, Joe Ripley, 11 Alive News.